In this problem, we're being asked to find the surface area of this rectangular prism. So we've got a rectangular prism that's 6 by 6 by 3 feet. What is the surface area of that? Well, what we need to do is find the area of each one of the faces or sides of this rectangular prism and then add all those together. Every rectangular prism is going to have six sides. And depending on the measures, well, you're always going to have at least pairs of sides that have the same dimension. So for example, this side right here in front is six by six. It's got a matching side in the back that is also six by six. So let's take care of those two sides right away. I'm just going to write this as two times six by six. And that's taking care of the front and the back. Let's try the sides now here. So this is six by three. So there's going to be two of those as well. So it's two times six by three. And then what about the top and the bottom? Well, it's six feet wide here and three feet along there. So these are also six by three. So the top and the bottom are going to be two more of the six by three. And then we just do our multiplication, 36 um, times, six times six is 36. Multiply that by two, we're going to get 72. 18, six times three is 18 times two is 36. And this one, is also 36. And then we add all of that together and we get 144. And then we need to remember our units. We're in feet, but this is area, so it's going to be square feet. So that is how to find the surface area of a rectangular prism.